Hey everybody and welcome to another edition of Where the Heck Are the Albans? And Where the Heck Are the Albans? Well, I am at home right now and I just wanted to let you guys know what's been happening. Why we haven't really filmed any new uh, content in the past couple weeks. Um, the fact of the matter is, is that Becky is very sick uh, and she is in the hospital right now. It started before the 4th of July, probably around the 2nd, uh, I believe, uh, of July. And she was having a lot of stomach issues, um, not to get too graphic, uh, diarrhea, a lot of vomiting, things like that. We thought that she might have caught a bug because Emerson was sick with like a little flu bug, like a 48-hour deal. Um, and but it just never really went away. It got a little better, but then it would get bad again, and then it would get better, and then bad again. So we, we just kind of waited it out um, until Sunday. Um, she started feeling pretty good on Sunday. She ate, and a couple hours later, she was in just massive pain. Pain level of 10. Um, once again, more diarrhea, more vomiting, but this time it was way worse than it had been ever. Um, like I said, pain level 10. She was just so sick, and she couldn't take the pain anymore, so she said, we've got to go to the ER. Um, and when we did this, uh, we, we, I, would, I took her to the ER. It was about a little after midnight. Um, that was Sunday night going into Monday. Um, and then they, uh, they ran some tests. They wound up having to put a tube down her nose that goes into her stomach. And, and they used suction to just basically get everything out. What they found was that she had an obstruction in her bowels and, um, bad stuff. So she's been in the hospital uh, since uh, a little past midnight, Monday morning, uh, Sunday night going into Monday morning, and she's still in the hospital. Uh, it is Wednesday evening now. I just came home from the hospital, but she is doing better. Um, so they ran some tests, things like that. It looks like she probably won't have to have surgery, which is a good thing. Uh, and they're hoping that the things that they're doing right now are are helping. Um, so we'll know more uh, tomorrow, and uh, hopefully everything will be okay. So just wanted to let you guys know, keep you guys updated, and let you know why you haven't seen anything from us for a few weeks. Just because when we do plan on going somewhere, she just she was just so sick, um, and that includes this past weekend and the weekend before that um so hopefully we'll be back out on the road soon uh hopefully we'll get some good news uh, some real good news tomorrow um and we'll find out a little bit more so um and i have been exhausted as well i had gotten up uh for work and then at like 6 30 in the morning wound up taking her to the doctor as I was just about to go to bed and then stayed up with her and I was up for like almost like 41 hours or something like that 41 or 42 hours straight so uh I crashed the other night <laughs> uh got some dinner for the kids and I and I wound up falling asleep with a sandwich in my hands um Vivian finally woke me up and said hey daddy why don't you put that in the fridge and go to bed? Uh, smart kid. Uh, so just wanted to let you guys know, give you guys an update uh, for our prayer warriors out there. You know, just keep Becky in your thoughts and your prayers. Uh, we really appreciate it. And uh, hopefully, like I said, we'll have some good news tomorrow. But I'll keep you guys updated on that, okay? So um, it kind of feels weird to do a, a regular closing of you know if you like what you see give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe down below but um but you know if you want to go for it <laughs> if you haven't already 
Uh, but we'll see you guys hopefully out on the road soon uh, once Becky gets better. Uh, and we'll see you guys next time on Where the Heck are the Albans? Bye, everyone.